is going on, Nitro Sites? It is your boy, the Nitro General here, back at it again for a brand new series, guys. Welcome to Pokemon Insurgents. <clears throat> now, I am so excited about this, guys. I really, really wanted to play this game on the channel. I'm super excited about it. Now, before we get into it, I just do just want to say one thing. Um... I know we've been playing our randomized Pokemon Black 2 Nuzlocke on the channel. I've been having a lot of fun with that, but when I booted it up today, unfortunately, something happened, and it deleted all of the data for, like, everything on my emulator. I have never had an issue with this emulator. I've used it for years. I've used it for probably five, six years now, and I've never had an issue with it. And when I booted it up today, it deleted the save files for everything right it was like the emulator had never been used brand new all the settings that i had changed a long time ago had been reset all the roms were just gone i would boot up some of the roms and they would just be reset completely like back to new game and unfortunately we can't continue the series because it deleted the save file and as much as I would love to just continue to read to do that series, it's kind of impossible at this point. Unless I was to completely play through the game, get to all the way back where we were, and make sure we have all the same Pokemon and everything like that. And it's... Honestly, guys, it's a little bit too much work to have to try to do that because I would have to make sure I have to go and catch all the same Pokemon that we did in every single route. I would have to make sure we have the same amount of items and the same amount of everything. And, and honestly, it's just so much of a hassle because that's like almost a month worth of recording that I would have to do in like one day in order to get it up for you guys. And I told you guys I wanted to do fan games on the channel and stuff like that. So uh, I intend to do that. And I would like to do another randomized Nuzlocke of another Pokemon game at some point. Um, and I fully intend on doing that. Um, we're not doing a Nuzlocke of this game. I mean, I guess we could, but... Eh, no, nah, I don't think we're going to do a Nuzlocke of this game. I have yet to play through this one through myself, so we're just going to have a normal playthrough of it. Um, this is a game that I personally absolutely love. I have I love the Pokemon Insurgents. I think it's a fantastic uh, game. I have never played through it personally myself, so I'm really, really excited to do that. So if you guys are excited for this brand new series, make sure you let me know no, by hitting that like button down below and subscribing if you guys are new. It does look like I am going to have a little bit of a new layout and stuff for you guys, so that might be cool. If you guys are excited for that, make sure you leave a like down below and subscribe if you're new too, because uh, I think that'll be cool. But uh, yeah guys, so I guess we'll just get right into it. We're going to hit new game. Unfortunately, I couldn't go to the title screen without it uh, you know, resetting all the settings that I did, so... Welcome to Pokemon Insurgents. Current version, what? Alright, alright. Would you like to play with a traditional or dark story? I mean, come on, guys. We, we gotta go with the dark one, right? We gotta go with the dark one. Yes. Um, if there are bad words in this, I will pro- I'm not gonna, like, bleep them out of the- Of the- Of the game itself, but I'm not gonna actually say them because I don't want to get demonetized, so- I cannot remember if this game actually has that or not, so. Oh man, look at it. It looks so nice. It looks so nice. Toggled auto run. I did not mean to hit that. Is there like a... I don't know if there's a square for you guys in the top left hand. I hope not. What's going on, huh? This game was really big a while back. The Torin region. One year ago. <clears throat> Alright. A brand new region, guys. Pokemon up to like Gen 6, I think it said, which was really which is really cool. Um, there's new Delta Forms, there's new Mega Evolutions. So cool. And yeah, so can I Oh, I had to press a button. I was wondering. Okay. Thank you all for coming. We live in dark times, my friends. A grave loss has recently befallen all of us. The Augur was a great man, 
Not only was he unmatched trainer, but his heart burned with the desire to protect his people. He was our hero, and possibly the best leader to the Torrent region has ever known. But, let's write on statues, that's kind of cool. As you know, where other regions have evil teams or organizations, it's Pokemon worshipping cults that call the Torn region home. But to these cults, religion is so much more than just believing. They won't reset until the... They won't... Oh. Reset. They won't re... They won't... Re <laughs> I cannot say that word, apparently. They will not rest until the world is remade exactly how they want it to be. <clears throat> For our protection, the Augur defeated and disbanded over half of them. He saved us. A week ago, he went searching for one of the remaining cults. He has not returned. He has not... <clears throat> he hasn't been seen since. People of Torin, <clears throat> I, like you, do not believe our Augur is dead. I assure you, I will search tirelessly until he is found. With a heavy heart, I accept the burden of taking this, his place until he is found. Until the first auger returns, I shall be the second. I promise you, I will use every resource at my disposal to find him. I bet you this guy's gonna be a bad guy. I don't remember anything about the story, by the way. Like, I don't remember anything. It's been a long time. We will stand our ground. We will not let these cultists, these insurgents, split apart our families and destroy the place we call home. Long live the Torn Region. Long live the Torn Region. We will remain strong. Hell yeah. Oh, look, look at that Gengar in the background. Would you like to do a challenge run of this game? Lock or similar? <sighs> I don't think so. I think we're just going to do a normal one. Yeah, I think we're just going to do a normal playthrough for the first time. Maybe eventually we'll do something. Hello? Is this thing working? Can you hear me? <clears throat> oh, thank Arceus. You're not just gone yet. You've got to listen to me. It'll return any minute now. You need to stay focused and remember all you can. If you value your memories at all, you'll listen to what I have to say. We need to be quick. You at least remember your name, right? Yes. We are going to go with Nitro G. Hell yeah. Are you sure? I mean, I think so. Okay, okay, good. You remember your name. What else do you remember? Are you a boy or are you a girl? Well, that doesn't really help. I think I'm a boy. And do you remember what you look like? Hey. Uh, oh, this is pretty cool. I like the middle one. I'm not going to lie. That, little, that middle one looks kind of snazzy. We're going to go with the middle. Are you sure? Yes. Thank goodness. You haven't forgotten everything. Gengar. <clears throat> it is here, Nitrogen, that you need to wake up. I've sent someone to fend it off and get you out of here. You need to wake up. <clears throat> you were in a simulation. Are they supposed to look like Darkrai? That's pretty cool. Alright, the door is locked, and Gengar is doing her thing. Soon, Dream Eater will rid the prisoner of the last of his memories. Hopefully, we'll be done within the hour. <clears throat> well, how is our youngest prisoner faring? According to the computer, Miss per Persephone, their memories should be completely gone very soon. Everything is going as planned. Excellent. Finally, we'll have, our we we'll have fulfilled our end of the bargain. Good work, you two. We're starting the ritual soon in the upstairs room. <clears throat> Will you be attending? Of course, miss. I would never miss a sacrifice. Very well. I'll see you upstairs then. Miss, wait. I have a question. <clears throat> After the child's memories are gone, what do you plan on doing with them? Kill them, of course. I expect you upstairs within two minutes. They're gonna kill me? I'm too young to die. Why are we bothering to wipe their memories if we're just going to kill them anyways? No clue, but, but thanks for not asking that in front of her. You know how she hates to be questioned. Let's go upstairs, then. It's always fun to see a ritual being performed. Dude, this music is popping, bro. Some good-ass music, man. I like that. Mew? Mew, mew, mew. Hey, Mew. <laughs> Mew. Mew will always be probably my favorite mythical. I absolutely love Mew. It is such a beautiful Pokemon. It's, such, it's just so adorable. I love it. The Gengar's gone. Go. Follow Mew. Get out of here and never look back. Good luck. 
Whoa. Okay. Do I get to battle with me? That's kind of cool. Can I talk to it? Me seems to try and trying to be tell Mew seems to be trying to tell Nitro G something with their eyes. Okay. Can I go in here? There are potions. Do I get to battle with Mew? That would be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool. I can get in here, right? Do I need a key or something? Fingerprint scanner. I don't know what the start. If I remember right, I think you could choose from like all the starters up to Gen 8. Or Gen 6, I think. Can I get anything from here? It's a bookcase that reads The Cult of the Torn Region. Would you like to read it? As much as I would like to to, to do the lore, I don't think I'm going to waste that time. <clears throat> We're already 10 minutes into this episode, so. Alright, that door is locked. Why is Mew, like, Mew is still undecided for whether traveling with Nitro G is a good thing or not. Then why did you come to wake me up and save me? Why are you, like, disappeared? <clears throat> Mew's holding a small note. I chose Mew to help you out of this mess due to its special ability. It's able to use transform to change its form and disguise itself as something else. However, unlike Ditto, Mew can transform you as well. If you can find DNA, Mew can disguise you as someone else. You should be able to use this to escape the base. Good luck, Benefactor. Alright. My DNA, huh? I can change so I can look like somebody else. Can you change it so I, I can, I can, I'm attractive so I can be a girl? Oh God! There's dried up blood splattered on the ground. Obtain a DNA of a dark cultist. So, right, let's. Okay, I thought maybe I'd talk to her. Transform. Ooh, uh, look at that! I get to be <clears throat> a darker. So you're telling me they killed some of their own cult members? That's kind of scary. Well, actually. I kind of want to go down and then see if I can... What, what what happens if I try to get into these doors that I couldn't get into before? Uh, yeah. Okay, so there's a potion here. I don't know if that's really going to help me too much, but... Uh, well, we'll have to see. There's absolutely nothing in there. I, I, you know, I, I'd like to see the fact that... You know, even these fan-made games are just like Pokemon in the in the thing where like you could go and do something or oh, repel, and you know, still have it have no actual thing. Obviously, there might be a hidden item in there, but why would there be a hidden item in there when it's impossible? When I don't even think it's possible for us to come back here after, even if there is a item finder. So it's like I doubt there's anything in there. All right. Now let's go up here and see if we can get through this door. We should be able to. <clears throat> uh, oh, there's a dark grass statue. What's up here? I like how the, the items actually show. Ice heal. Uh, another potion. Dude, this music is popping. I really like this. I really like this music, guys. This is pretty dope. Okay, what's, is there Pokemon in this thing? I don't think there is, damn it. I was hoping there would be Pokemon for me to steal. Can I go up here? Am I supposed to go up here? Persephone's finally decided to give up the summoning of Darkrai another try. Last time, it just flew away. How, sh how does she know that's not gonna happen again? Well, it probably will. More items. I love how they're giving me all these, and it's like, I don't even know if it'll be possible for me to use it. Am I supposed to be here? Because then I, if, if I am, I'm... Oh. I should have went the other way then. Nah, it doesn't matter. And so we begin. <clears throat> Miss, please, you can't do this. I don't want to die. You swore when you joined that you would give your life for us. How is this any different? Activate the ritual cycle. Oh, this dude, this dude's about to die. Darkrai, Lord of Darkness, I call upon you to enter our world. In return, I offer you the soul of this loyal servant to be bound to your world of nightmares forever. Voco Virtrum Umbarum Damium. Man, that poor kid. That's a Z, not a D. Is that gonna be Zygarde? That's it? 
It's so cool that somebody literally designed this, though. That's so cool. That's so cool. This looks so dope. Although, do you really think Darkrai would murder somebody when he just... I mean, maybe. I mean, he's literally like a, a ghost. Darkrai, the Lord of Nightmares. You are the great balancer of the world. You punish that great and slay the immortal. It has been a year since I saw you last. You remember what occurred then? We accomplished something incredible that day. I thought finally you had accepted our offer to join us. But you fled soon after, never to be seen again. But now I call upon you, and Darkrai, why will you not join me? The time and time again, why do you favor her over me? I bless you, I bless you Darkrai. Join me. Join the cult that has worshipped me for so long. With my guidance and your power, the world will be ours. <clears throat> and there it goes. Wow, it's almost like Darkrai doesn't want you. Well, isn't that just lovely? It's probably gone off to Selene City to see my sister again. What a waste of a grunt. And what do you two want exactly? Miss, please. I I'm confident that if we had another try, we could trap Dark right here. We don't know why it didn't work this time. But if you just give us another chance. Get out of my way. Fire Blast. I'm going to go check on the prisoner. None of you had better follow me. So am I supposed to follow her then? Or can I go up here and see what happens? So that dude, apparently he's just vaporized because his blood's like nowhere to be seen. So apparently Darkrai just came in and was like, Alright, I'm going to take this dude for me. I don't know, because obviously, obviously she's probably going to be pissed off. Uh, what's up here, though? Um, there's encounters. There's your grass there. Can I... Wait, can I catch other Pokemon here? I don't think I have Pokeballs, though. There's a Nidoran and female. Oh! Level 65 Mew. <laughs> Alright, well, I don't think we're actually supposed to be out here right now. I think we're actually supposed to go back down. I don't think there's really anything. I mean, this might be where we go to escape. I should probably... Oh, wait. Okay, never mind. The leader of the call is looking for me. I should probably escape. Oh, yeah, he transformed me back into to me. Are you careful there? Don't disturb a lumberjack while they're working. So you're telling me you've just been cutting wood while this cult has been murdering people in a cave that's literally 10 seconds from where you're standing right now? All right, man. That's that. That's perfectly cool. What is this? Oh, I can't get to it. Can I get to it? I don't know. I also don't know what the shiny chances are in the game. Pikachu! I don't know what the shiny chances are. Um... I'll have to look it up, and if I remember, I'll put it, like, I'll put it, like, right here, but I don't know if it will be or not. There's a small flute and another, and another note in Mew's hands. Obtain the quartz flute. Venture G for the quartz flute. Okay, that's probably where I can call Mew at any time to transform into other people, probably. This flute lets you call upon Mew when needed, yeah. To use it, go into your bag and either use it directly or register. Good luck. Your benefactor. So, I think if I remember right, there's, like, different mythical Pokemon. I think there's like a Celebi and stuff too you can call on by using other flutes throughout the game, which is kind of cool. I could swear I saw Mew here just now. Did you see it? A tiny pig Pokemon? It was floating really close to you. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, I could swear I... My name is Damien and I'm an inspiring Pokemon trainer. And you are? Nitro G. Got it. You came to Telenor Town at the perfect time. The Augur, the greatest man in the world, of course, is coming today. You know who the Augur is, right? Uh, yeah. Of course you do. Who wouldn't? He's only the most, most amazing person ever. The mayor and the townsfolk have been preparing ever since this morning. I'm excited. I was just running errands before he arrived. I know, why don't you help out? We're assigning jobs in the town hall. You know, cleaning and so on. I don't know what the... Uh, I don't know what the... Okay... I don't know what the, uh, the autosave is. 
Is there is there a saving? Is there a do I have like a oh how did I do that? <laughs> I have no idea how I did that. Wait, I wanna try is it Oh it's X, okay. Alright, let's save because I want to there's a different game file that is already saved. No there isn't! <laughs> uh there it must just be Is it that really that quick? Oh, that's why. Because it auto does it to no. There is not another save file. I have never played this game before on this computer. I think I might have downloaded it and tried to play it on a different computer, but it didn't really work out. Wow, I, I am lightning fast. I need a Pokemon. Is this Town Hall? I'm guessing it's the Town Hall. Wow, I'm so fast. I'm going to draw the Augur a portrait when you see me. After all, everyone's in the town is supposed to give him a gift. Well, apparently I'm not. I don't know. Am I supposed to talk to people in here? I can't remember. Buzz off, kid. We're not here to talk to you. Well, I am not going to talk to everybody here. I'm sure there's something I have to do. Let's go go in these houses because you never know what you'll, you'll get. I kind of feel bad for Damien. All the other town, all the other kids in town got a Pokemon and left, but he wasn't allowed to. Why not? Oh my god, I am so fast I can't do anything. I gotta toggle off. Okay. People call him the auger, but that's not quite right. He's actually the second auger. The first one retired a while ago. Retired? I thought he disappeared. Technology's amazing! Hey! There's the there's the dudes. This is like a starting city. So is this the town hall then? Oh wait, is this where I get starter Pokemon? Please. Hello, I'm Professor Sylvian! I'm the professor of this town. I suppose you want to start your Pokemon adventure. Most other kids in the neighborhood have already gotten their Eevee from me and headed north to the trainer school in Midna Town. You'll have to wait a little bit, though. The town is busy preparing for the Augur's arrival, and so am I. Why don't you come back later? God damn it. I want a Pokemon. I don't want to end this episode without having a Pokemon. You gonna give me anything? I'm only six now, but I'll be old enough to get my Pokemon. I can't wait. Most of the gyms in the Torrent region are based around a theme, rather than a type. For example, Xavier, the leader in Vipic City, has a forest-themed gym, which means he uses both poison and bug types. Couldn't that also mean he uses grass and flying types? If it's a forest theme, but... Okay. Uh, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. You know where I'm supposed to go, old lady? The second auger is the most amazing person ever. They say he's so... Okay, I'm gonna talk to everybody in here because I feel like there's... Oh, wait, no, there's Damien. I'm supposed... Ah. Yeah. I was like... There... I knew I was missing something. I finished cleaning up the road. Is there anything else I can do? Oh, this is Nitro G. I met them outside. They offered to help, too. Nice to meet you, Nitro G. Well, Damien, I think we're pretty well finished. As long as you have your gift for the auger ready, I think you're done. You do have your gift, right? Oh. Well, um... I may have forgotten. Of course you have. You better find one. And fast. I heard you could find a rare stone in one of the caves in the forest. Of course you'd need a Pokemon to go there safely. No, absolutely not. Not a chance. Damien is not ready to get a Pokemon. He's still just a child. Mom, please. Everyone else in the in the town already got theirs and have left. And you're not going to follow them. You'll get yourself killed. You'll shoot your eye out. Why do you care? It's not like you're my real mother or anything. I've raised you since birth. You're not capable of raising a plant, let alone a Pokemon. You're irresponsible, antisocial, and you can't even... That is enough out of you two. You're embarrassing us. You said your name was Nitro G? I'm sure you've handled a Pokemon before. We'll lend one to both you and Damien. Would you be willing to help him through the forest and cave to help him find a gift for the auger? Sure. Wonderful. I'm very grateful. So it is settled that Nitro G will help Damien get a gift for the auger, and if Damien shows responsibility, perhaps he can keep the Pokemon afterwards. Well, how does that sound? Fine. He won't, though. Nitro G, let's go. Okay. I'll meet you in the professor's lab to get an Eevee. She has a bunch of Eevees from her days as a trainer. The lab is just southeast corner of this town. I'll see you there. I really hope I don't mess this up. Hey, Nitro G, thanks for agreeing to do this with me. It really means a lot. So, is it a guaranteed Eevee that we get for a starter? I can't remember. I mean, I mean that would, that would kind of be cool. Because then, you know, we could get whatever Eevee evolution we want. And if there's, I don't know, if there's like a Delta version of it. I don't know. Listen, Professor, these Pokemon, they're freaks. No other trainer would want them. And we can't keep them any longer. All I want is for you to take them. You already already keep a bunch of Eevee as it is. Surely these three won't be a bother. Why do you care about them? I know what you've done. 
It's true, I'm merciless. I've done some awful things, but there's no reason for these Pokemon to die. Um, hello? I'm Damien. This is Nitro G. We're here to get a Pokemon so we can go into the forest safely. Uh, you gonna, you gonna talk to me there, bro? Sivian, if you don't take these Pokemon, I'll release them and they're sure to die in the wild. If you want, you can just give them to these kids, right? Put them on the table. Very well. Excuse me, please. So I think we might have an option of getting an Eevee or one of those three Pokemon, whatever they are. So you two are in need of a Pokemon. Yes, ma'am. I see. That man was in here just now. He was one of my colleagues in the university. He's a smart man and a great scientist. He's also the leader of the cult of perfection. Uh, a, a cult leader? Those people are evil, Professor. You shouldn't even be talking to them, let alone accepting gifts from them. Tell me, Damien and Nitro G, have you ever heard of something called Delta Species? Uh, yeah, I have. Well, I haven't. Now allow me to explain. Delta Pokemon are based on the phenomenon in the Holo region. They're the Pokemon that have different DNA than normal Pokemon. Simply put, they're typed differently than normal. An example would be an Electric-type Dragonite or a Water... Oh, yeah! There's the three Canto Delta Canto starters. I forgot about that. These Pokemon on the table now are Deltas. I'm not sure what type they are, but they seem to be experiment experiments of Bulbasaur, Charmander, and Squirtle. They're scientific marvels. I would love to keep one to study. Now, normally, I would give you an Eevee as your Pokemon to start off your journey. However, it seems there are more options for you to choose from. So, I will offer you this. You may choose one of the three Delta Pokemon to travel with, or the Eevee I normally give, give away. If you want an Eevee, talk to me. Otherwise, take your pick. That's your G. I don't know what to do. I don't like the idea of Pokemon made by a murderer, but I don't like the ideas of these Pokemon to be left alone forever. You can pick, but hurry up. We don't know when the Augur is arriving. Okay, so I'm not taking an Eevee. I'm definitely taking one of the Delta species. So we have the Fairy and Psychic-type Pokemon Bulbasaur. Okay, Fairy and Psychic. We have the Ghost and Dragon Delta Charmander. <laughs> and the Dark and Fighting-type Pokemon Delta Squirtle. I gotta go with the Charmander as much as I don't want to. Dragon and Ghost are literally my top two favorite typings. Dude, that looks so cool. I gotta pick him. I'm going with Delta Charmander. I have to. I have to. I, I can't not pick anything else. Would you like to give a name to him? Yeah, let's name him... A ghost and a dragon type? Uh, oh, God. What should we name this thing? I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think of a good name for, like, a, like a ghost or a dragon type. Uh, okay, how about this? We'll name him Wisp. I like Wisp. Because it's like, a, you know, like a little Will of the Wisp. It's like a fire ghost type thing. It's, it's cool, right? He's, he's, he, is, he used to be a fire type. At least the regular Charmander is. Nutri G, I think you're right. I'm going to pick a Delta Pokemon just like you. Hey, Nitro G, before he picked the Bulbasaur. Hey, Nitro G, before we go out of the Shade Forest, how about a battle? It'll be a perfect time to test out our new Pokemon. Let's go! <clears throat> oh, and there's following Pokemon in this. Rival Damien would like to battle. Oh my god, he looks so cool. Uh, I mean, he's a funny type, so he's gonna resist Scratch. I think we have to go Twister. <clears throat> Tail whip. Oh, you're lowering my defenses. Oh, it even shows the defense drops things on the on the left. That's pretty cool. But you just you just lost. How are you gonna be a Delta Charmander? <clears throat> my God. Wow, you're a great battler. Do you think maybe you could take on a gym someday? All right, Nestor G. Here's the deal. I'm going to head north into Shade Forest. At the northern end of the forest is a really large cave, and in the middle of that cave is the rare stone we're looking for. I'll meet you there, okay? Mr. G, can I talk to you for a moment? Damien rushed off before I give him one, but I'd like you to have this. Oh, a Pokedex? Oh, I was waiting for the dun 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 dun, dun sound, but there was not one. This is the Pokedex, short for Pokemon Index. It's a data collection of all Pokemon that I give to trainers. If you see a Pokemon, it will be registered in the Pokedex. If you catch one, the Pokedex will be full of data regarding that Pokemon. Anyways, now that you've gotten, gotten that, you should be all set on your adventure. Head up north to Telenor Cave deep in the forest. Be careful and good luck. Alright, so is there a way for us to get Pokeballs? Uh, I don't know if there's, uh, if in the Pokemon Center there's a shop. Oh, it looks like there is. So let's heal up our Pokemon from that battle quick. And then let's talk to this dude and see if he'll give us some Pokemon. Yeah! Uh, 16. I think we're good with 10 for right now. Um, and then we'll get, I'll get a couple potions. 
Wait, no, I don't want to just one. Oh, well, we can only get four. That's fine. All right. <clears throat> okay, yeah, I know I don't have enough money. There's a B button. That's stupid. Okay. <clears throat> All right, now that we have the Charmander, uh, we can go up to the cave. And we can, we should be able to catch a... I don't think I really want a Weedle. In level 5? That's kind of crazy for a first, for like a Route 1 Pokemon. Don't you poison me. This game, 31 XP points. Okay, cool. Oh, those, uh, those things are gone here. What is this? Obtained the Dex Nav. Ooh. Wait, really? Click here to scan. No Pokemon data was found for this area. Oh man. Okay. Okay, I don't know what I don't know what that means, but catch Pokemon to have them appear here. Uh, how do I get rid of it? Would you which trainer would you like to battle? What? No, I don't want to. I don't want to battle any- I don't want to battle any of them. I don't want to battle any of them. Come on, Eastwood! What? <laughs> I don't want to- I don't want to battle any of them. I don't want to battle any of them. Let me go. Let me get out of here. Uh... No. How do I- how do I get out of here? Connecting to server, press C. Connection successful. No, I just want to get. Okay, cool. I'm like, I just want to get out of the deck snap. That's so. That's so stupid. Toggle. I don't know. I want. I want to run. Let's see what else we can get here. Oh well, there's a trainer battle. This this forest is a bit dangerous. Shouldn't you be at home? Hike your max and out much shot. Alright, we should be able, easily be able to beat him a job. We'll hit it with a twister. Focus energy. Alright. I think we'll probably end off this episode here in a minute. Maybe we'll look to see what else is in this, uh... In this forest, and then we'll probably... 99, oh, we get to level 8, which is pretty cool. That's quite a Pokemon you have there. Yeah, it is, because it's a Delta species, my guy. See if there's anything else in here. There's a Ghastly. But I don't want to have to. We already have a Ghost type, so there's no reason for me to try to get that. But. Alright, we'll probably battle him. Alright. A Bug type? Oh my god, having a Dragon type this early in the game is busted. I mean, fan-made games like this may, might be balanced a little bit different, but starting off with a dragon or like a steel-type Pokemon is insane because they have so many resistances that it's just like, especially against like normal-type moves, which is like all Pokemon have at the beginning of games like this, it's crazy. I just want to see what other Pokemon there are here before we... Are there anything good that we can catch here? I think it's just all going to be bug Pokemon. I don't think there's anything. We're going to battle this last trainer, and then I'm going to end off this episode, guys. So, all right, man. <clears> hey, <throat> hope you're ready to be crushed by my superior Pokemon. Man, unless you have, like, a Darkrai or an Arceus or something. Patrat? A Patrat? Really? Patrat sucks, man. Oh, I just realized the flame on Charmander's tail has a little bit of a face on it. That's kind of cool. Oh man, dude, this music, I mean, obviously this is the normal music, but this this game has some good soundtracks. Alright, wait, what's your other Pokemon? A pit of. So you came from the Innova region then, obviously. I mean, I don't even know why we would even use Scratch at this point, since it's not even stabbed. Why, why are none of these Pokemon, like, attacking at all? They're all just, like, lowering my defenses at Hell yeah. I, I lost? Did you cheat? Y yeah, man. I'm cheating because I have a Delta species. Ooh, there's a Pokeball here. 
I want to go But, <clears throat> alright guys. So, I think this is a great place to end off this episode of Pokemon Insurgents. If you guys did enjoy this, let me know by hitting that like button down below. Subscribing if you guys are new. Sharing this video with your friends. All that good stuff. Uh, check out the other series we have on the channel. Again, I am sorry that we unfortunately cannot continue our Pokemon Black 2 randomized Nuzlocke. Um, only because... Only because the data got deleted. Nothing that I did. Um, I don't know how it happened. I might have done something, but again, I'm sorry about that. But, uh, yeah, guys, so that is everything for me. So, like I say at the end of every video, I am the Nitro General. I really hope you guys do enjoy, and I will see you in the next episode. Nitro General is out. Peace.